Xiaomi unveiled MIUI 9 few weeks ago in China and now they have finally released the global beta ROM. The MIUI 9 has bring lots of newly added features like this split screen mode, new icons, new animation, deep level system optimization and many more. So if you guys are impatient as me and wanted to try out MIUI 9 right now, then you are watching the right video. Now before we get started, I wanted to make this clear that as of now, MIUI 9 is still in beta and OT update is not arriving anytime soon for your Xiaomi devices. But in my testing, I found that the MIUI 9 ROM is pretty stable and everything is working just fine. So this is a video of me of installing MIUI 9 on my Redmi Note 4X and this method will also work with all the other Xiaomi devices. So now with that being said, let's start. Now the MIUI 9 is rolling out in 3 batches. The first batch of supported devices are Redmi Note 4 or 4X and the Mi 6 which has been released to public on 11th August. The second batch of the supported devices are Mi Mix, Mi Note 2, Mi 5, Mi 5S, Mi 5S Plus, Mi Max 2, Mi Max and Redmi 4 4X which will most probably release in the 3rd or 4th week of August. And these are the supported device for the final batch which is expected to release in late September. Now at the time of making this video, MIUI 9 is only available for Redmi Note 4X and Mi 6, so I'll be using my Redmi Note 4X. But as I said before that, this method will also work with other Xiaomi devices too. Now the prerequisites are, first, your bootloader should be unlocked, second, you should have pre-installed TWRP recovery. Now if you don't have an unlocked bootloader and pre-installed TWRP recovery, then I'll be leaving the links of the video in the description down below, so do check out. Now once that is done, boot your device into TWRP recovery mode and for that first switch off your device. Now press and hold volume up plus power key at the same time until you see this me logo. This will basically boot your device into TWRP recovery. So after successfully booting up into TWRP recovery, the very first thing that I always recommend is to make a backup of your current ROM because in case you don't like the ROM or you wanted to go back to your previous ROM, then just go to restore section and from there you can restore the previous ROM. It's as simple as that. So after backup is done, go back and click on wipe, then advanced wipe. From here select Delvic system data cache and swipe this blue button to right. This will basically wipe your system partitions and make your device ready for ROM installation. Once that is done, go back and click on install and navigate the ROM zip file which we downloaded earlier and select it. Now again swipe this blue button to right in order to flash the ROM zip file. The installation will take anywhere between 3 to 5 minutes so just relax. Once the installation is done, a pop-up will appear which says no OS is installed. Just overlook that and swipe this to reboot your device. Now again the first boot will take around 5 to 10 minutes which is quite normal. So wait till the boot is finished. Now as you can see, we have successfully installed the MIUI 9 ROM on our devices. Just set up your device and enjoy the new MIUI 9 ROM which brings lots of new changes and features to the table. Now in my usage, I pretty much like the ROM. It's fast and responsive as you would expect from a new update and it also offers some really cool new features. Now I'll be doing a full review of MIUI 9 in few days. So if you are new to this channel, then do consider subscribing. And for more future updates, click the bell icon so that you never misses any future videos from Extreme Droid. So this is Samir signing off and I'll see you guys in my next one.